Hello beautiful people and welcome back again to OnHow channel. For people that don't know, my name is Enes, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop on below in a comment. I will be happy to make a video for you. And for people that do know, welcome back. You already know. If you have any questions, make sure to drop on below. I will be happy to make a video for you as well. Same as the over 100 videos now I made on Shopify customization. And they were mostly, not all of them, but mostly requests by subscribers and some of them not even subscribers. But I'm fine with that. Just a like button will help me out. And in this video, I will show you how to hide the price only on some specific collections on your Shopify store. And yes, I said collections, not just one collection. So this trick or the code that I will share with you will actually do this on two collections, not just one. And you can pick if you want to do it only on one or two, obviously. So you can hide because earlier I did post a video on how to hide the product title only on some specific collections. And I got the request on how to hide the prices as well. I think it's the same guy who requested the previous video. I'm not sure though, I'm not sure, but I think it's the same. Anyway, so in this video, as I said, I will show you how to hide the prices only on some specific collections on your Shopify store without using any apps or anything like that. And it's completely free, just a like button, as I said. And let's just quit talking and let's just jump to it. As you can see, this is the Shopify store I do use. Uh, I mean the dashboard, and this is the team I do use to do all the demonstration on which is the, I have the latest version as of now, which is the 15, but I have other teams as well. The most used, the free ones, I have them as well, which is Taste, Sense, Refresh, Spotlight, and Trade. And if you are wondering why is that, because I do actually implement the trick on all of these teams. So even if you're not using down team, you're using one of these, it will work for you as well. No worries. And as I said, even if it didn't or there is an update that broke something, simply drop me a comment. I will be happy to provide you the information you need in order to fix the issue or do the thing you're trying to do. Again, for the second time, let's just quit talking and let's just jump to it. So let me access the uh, Shopify uh, collection from here. Let me from categories and tech accessories. So let's just do demonstration on this one. And we will do it on two actually, no worries. So as you can see, there is prices for the products in here and we will hide the prices only on this tech accessories. So the first thing you're going to do is obviously access Shopify dashboard. And we will keep this open so we can see the trick in action. So after that, click on the three dots on left of customize and click on edit code and it will take you to the code editor. Next thing, simply use the search bar at the top left corner and type in team and you will see team.liquid. And this file exists on every Shopify team. So no worries, simply click on it and bunch of code in here. Yeah, I know it can be confusing. Simply click on it like you wanna write something on the code and don't, <laughs> simply click, right, just click. Then if you are on Windows, click on Control F on the keyboard, I mean. If you are on Mac like me, simply click on Command F and it will show you this prompt at the bottom of the page and we need to type in here forward slash and head like this without any space. Then hit enter and it will highlight it on the code for you, as you can see. So let's just close this. And as you can see, we have script and head. We need some space between of them because we will paste in a code in here. So simply click on script front of it and hit enter and here it is a new space. And the next thing you're going to do is, as always, scroll down the description box and you will see a link named it as code and simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see a very short code, five lines to be exact. And this code again is completely free. No pay please, no share please, just a like button will help me out. I really appreciate that. And wait actually to see if this video helped you out, then hit the like button. And don't ever press the dislike button. It's not working anymore, it's broken. <laughs> so only the like button. So let's just select the code in here. Make sure to select the whole thing. If you miss the bracket, it will not work. So right click and copy. After that, simply let's just paste it in the space we did create. Just like this and let me show you in the black background so you can see clearly here so as you can see it says handle and between the, those two quotes there is collection dash handle as you can see and there is again another one your collection handle which is two so I, if you are a subscriber of my channel i think you already know what to do right <laughs> but no worries for people or the new people 
I'm here for you. So get back in here to the collection you want to try or do the trick on and you see the URL says collections forward slash tech accessories. The thing from our collection forward slash is the handle. Simply select it from the URL right here and copy and get back in here and place it from, uh, in place of collection dash handle just like this. And let's just do the trick on the first collection first to see if it works or not. So let's just click on save button. And as you can see, there is prices here. So let's just reload the page. And ta-da, as you can see, no more prices. And for the other one, <laughs> again, simply access the, shop, uh, the Shopify collection you want to do the trick on. And as you can see, there is prices. God damn, $600 for sandals. I don't know where that came from. Anyway, so <laughs> let's just uh, select the handle for it again copy we get back in here and replace it in the second one like this save get back and the 600 will be gone and that's how it should be no sandal like this will cost 600 anyway that's how you re <laughs> that's how you hide uh, the products prices only on some specific collections for your Shopify store without using any apps or anything like that. And if you have any questions, drop them below. But for now, I think my job is done. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.